Hi guys, welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. I'm Bianca Estelle. If you're not new here, hey ladies and gems, welcome back. So today we're gonna be doing our unboxing for Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. This is our lovely bag for the month. Um, it is for April of 2021. I am a little late. I know we're into May, so I do apologize. But nonetheless, if you haven't gotten a chance to get into this bag, it is a $25 per month uh, subscription. You do get $120 worth of items in here or more. You get to choose three of the items in this bag and they're all gonna be full size items, guys, okay? And you also get this drawstring bag. So let's open our bag and see what we got for this month. Like I previously said, guys, this is our bag for this month. Um, to me, I don't know. It looks like it's like cact cactuses, leaves, and like little lipstick prints. Um, tell me, are you guys still feeling the drawstring bags? I'm not really feeling the drawstring bags too much. Um, just because I don't know what I would use it for other than gifting something to somebody for like their birthday or whatever. Um, so I'm still hoping that soon that they will give us the option of basically either, um, you know, denying or saying that we don't want the bag and maybe we can get an extra item in our bag. I don't know, maybe something in the future, Ipsy, think about it. So first things first, we want to see if we have a card in here. And lately, the items have not been on the card for the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, which is kind of a bummer. Um, so the items are not on this card at all, but the theme for April of 2021 is Force of Nature. And it says, whether you love your naked face, hashtag skincare is the new foundation, or feel naked without your red lipstick, do what feels natural to you. When confidence is the first step in your routine, you can't be stopped. So that's a cute message for the month. Um, so guys, we don't have a card with the details of all our products in here or the price. So I'm going to bring my tablet out and we're going to continue on with this video. So the first product that we have is from Honest Beauty. This is their Everything Cream Foundation. And it says it has buildable coverage and it's a velvety finish and seamlessly blendable. Um, that's the Honest Beauty of our Demi Matte Cream Foundation formulated with nourishing jojoba oil, vitamin E, and pigments that blend smoothly and evenly. Okay, seems pretty good. So some of the facts about this are key benefits. It says it's flexible, it's supposed to be medium to full coverage, smooth, velvety texture, seamless finish, demi matte, easy to blend formula. So I have the color amber. Um, we're gonna take a look and see if she is my color so this is the color that i have we're gonna give a little swatch and then i'm gonna rub a little bit on my chin to see how it looks i'm not sure if this is going to be my color it kind of looks pretty neutral it doesn't it looks warm on top but as i'm taking that first layer off it actually looks pretty pretty neutral. This foundation actually only comes in, I think, 12 shades. I don't know. It could work for me. So we'll see. I'm going to give a little swatch on my chin down here. Yeah, it's very neutral. So it's going to be looking kind of ashy on me. Um, for it only to be eight shades, I kind of wish that they would have let us pick our color, like giving us the option to pick multiples, you know what I'm saying? Kind of like what BoxyCharm does. But yeah, it is definitely really neutral on my skin. And of course, it's giving me that ashy white cast. Um, let's take a look at the next item. Next, we have the Tracy. This is their color contour and cheek stick. 
Um, so this retails for $28 and it says a revolutionary cream gel vegan bronzer that applies like silk um, plus built-in brush that blends color for a contoured cream to powder finish. So guys, this only comes in one color, um, and that's the Brazilian Bronze. Um, I'm not sure how I'm feeling about that, but we're going to take a look at this product. So there goes the brush at the bottom. Um, I think that's as big as it doesn't retract or anything. It just has a cap on here. So it's kind of like a flat kabuki. And then this is what the color looks like. Don't know if this is going to be a color for me. Trying to see if we can, does it not, is that all the product that we get? Okay, I guess it doesn't, oh, there it goes, now it's going up. So let's see how much product we have in here. So not very much, but that's what you get. We'll do a little swatch. And see what we get, guys. I'm not saying that this is going to be a promising color. Um, may not be flattering for everybody. So that's the color that we're getting. Not bad. We'll try it right here and see what happens. And we'll try this brush that they gave us. does seem to blend pretty good. Not my favorite contouring product, but I'm just trying to see how muddy it would look. It's kind of muddy on my skin, but. And I wouldn't apply it this far down my cheek, but as you see, it kind of just blended away. So definitely, well, you can kind of see some there, but it's one of those foolproofs that kind of reminds me of the Fenty Beauty Contour, um, or actually their bronzing um, cream uh, product they just came out with, guys. Okay, so let's take a look at the next item. We have the Shayna B Miami Eyes on Miami brush set. So this brush set is supposed to be $60.00. <laughs> um, it is a five-piece full-size brush set, and it says this five-piece kit has all the tools you need to DIY everything from a subtle daytime look to a glam nighttime uh, smoky eye. Each brush is made with an ultra-soft synth synthetic bristle that allows you to blend, buff, and build shadows like a pro. Um, and it says these are vegan and cruelty free. This is actually a repeat item for me. And I can say the brushes are pretty nice. They're very beginner friendly. Um, this will also be dropped into your guys' giveaway box. Okay, guys. So let's get into the next item. We have the Belle and Argent Pamoranic Eyeshadow Palette and Nude Intuitive Vision. A retail value is $30. It is a full-size product, and it says versatile and fuss-free. This collection of eight neutral eyeshadows can be worn for day or night. Um, they're highly pigmented and easy to blend and create zero fallout. Hmm, pretty nice. So let's take a look. So this is what the eyeshadow palette looks like outside of the box. So you do have that reflective mirror um, outside packaging and it does list the eyeshadow names on the back. You do get a nice mirror in this box. And like they said, this palette is definitely on the neutral side of things. So just like some warm browns with shimmers is what we're seeing right here what do you guys think i don't think it's bad especially for ipsy considering okay guys let's get into our last item 
So the last item that we have is from Miss You Beauty, and this is the Nail Lacquer Duo in Worthy and Diana. It retail values for $37, and it says these soft rose and poppy red lacquers coat nails in ultra shiny, shiny, chip resistant color that looks gorgeous on all skin types. It is vegan and cruelty free, guys. So I'm gonna pop this open, we'll take a look. I've actually received a couple of nail polishes from them before and they're actually not bad. So this is what they look like. This one is Worthy and this one is Diana. So they don't look bad, guys. So let's go ahead and jump into these final thoughts. Okay, ladies and gems, so what do we think about all of our Ipsy products for our Glam Bag Plus for April 2021? Uh, we did get quite some different products in here. So we did get an eyeshadow for this month. Um, this is what she kind of looked like. This was not bad. I'm actually happy that they gave brushes with this as well. Um... So I think that was one of my picks was the eyeshadow. I'm not sure. Um, we did get the compact for Honest Beauty. Um, I'm kind of disappointed that it was not my color because that outside coating looks very warm, which is what I was going for when I picked this product. And I wish they would have had more shades because I think if I would have seen something a little bit warm, I think I would have picked that one. And considering that they only have 12... Um, shades doesn't really make me happy but also in that compact when you lift it up there is a sponge applicator down at the bottom which i think was pretty neat if this had been my color so so we got that the brushes the eyeshadow we got the tray seek this was the um i believe it was the contour yeah contour cheek stick um it's still on my cheek it's not very um out there but you can see it. Um, I guess you can say it's not a bad product. I believe it's very beginner friendly. Um, if you're just getting into makeup, I think this is something that would be very good for you. Um, considering, I think it was what, $28? A little cheaper than Fenty Beauty or some of the other bronzers out here, but there are a lot of drug stores that are a lot cheaper than this, and I think they're um, better uh, value, I should say, better quality. And then we got the nail polish duo, which are cute and I'm not mad at it. I've been trying to restock up on my nail polish colors and these aren't bad, guys. So guys, the value of my bag was, what was it? $176.99 and they promised 120 plus. So like I always say, the value is always there, but is your personal value there, which basically is, are you gonna use any of these products anytime soon in the next month? in the next year so did you get your money's worth did you get your bang for your buck that's the real question as far as the eyeshadow i think everything is good in here besides just the color match of this if the color match had been perfect with this i would have given this bag a five star like this is what i want my ipsy glam bag to look like no skincare i mean unless i ask for it but like all makeup. I love that this was like all makeup, all beauty items. So I, if I was a beginner and this was my first uh, plus bag, I don't think I would really be disappointed. I think there were a lot of good products in this uh, month's bags, guy, uh, guys. So tell me what you guys think of this bag. Leave me a comment at the bottom. Give me a like if you guys like this video. I hope you've already subscribed to our little channel here, guys. And make sure your notification bell is on so you always know when I upload my next videos. So I'll see you in the next one, guys. Love you. Bye.